I can't possibly eat this. This is terrible. <laughs> and if you have that problem too, you can sign up for HelloFresh and you get HelloFresh orders. Oh. Hello, oh, I'm Martin. And I'm Josh. And today we're continuing my taste of uh, Josh's favorite American uh, quick snacks when you need something to eat mm. and you don't have the time because you're working or whatever and yeah. you don't feel like cooking. Yeah, I, I think you'd call that like uh, Chinese, Japanese, American. <laughs> yeah, but um, ramen today. Yeah, quick and easy ramen, you know, another one, uh, mm. just like the ravioli and mac and cheese yeah. we've done earlier. Um, that's yeah. it, You make that a little differently. Now, I used to make the mistake where I would actually just fill it up to the line with tap water and then put the mm. styrofoam and everything in the microwave. Um, I don't think that's, I, I don't, that's not the way you're supposed no. to do it. And I don't know if maybe I've been poisoning myself all this time. but um, That explains a lot. Yeah. So um, what you're supposed to do is heat up water first to like boiling, yeah. boiling temperature. I'll do that. And then you just pour the water, the boiling water up to the line mm -hmm. and then close the lid. So you'll see um, the lid um, after you take the plastic and, and the, the wrapper all off. You, right. you take that cardboard off and then mm. take the plastic off. The plastic is sometimes a little bit of a challenge. Usually I use a... A pointy knife to kind of get in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then so, you'll see you peel the the paper tab. Mm, you peel that back yeah. to the line. <laughs> so yeah. you only peel it back about halfway. So I was looking at the uh, in the supermarket recently, and I saw we had something similar here. Okay. That you could buy. So it was, um, it, was, it was noodles in a like a styrofoam cup. That yeah, okay. it looks a bit like not the same brand, but. Mm -hmm. The same concept or something like that. I haven't, I haven't uh, had any of. Normally, those, the so. kind that I have is um, Nissan cup noodles. Mm -hmm. That's the one I prefer. Um, but I couldn't. I I went to a you know a couple stores collecting stuff for yeah. you, and um, for some reason I couldn't find cup noodles. So it says boiling water and let it sit for three minutes. Yep. Again, the three minutes. Yep. Uh -huh. Be careful, you don't yeah. burn yourself. Uh, yeah, I, I claim zero liability here. This is uh, at your own risk. <laughs> no, you're going to get a lawsuit <laughs> on your hands now. Oh, I felt... Oh, inside line. No, I did feel it's inside line, as I said. Yes, yes, yes. And usually I'll take, like, the fork that I'm going to eat with, and I'll just rest mm. it on top to close that lid up to so it gets mm. it steams up in there. Bingo. That's it. So we have to wait three minutes. Yeah, time it. Yeah, you, yeah. Um, I mean, you can obviously wait longer than that, but um, you don't want to eat it uh, any sooner than three minutes. No, 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 no. Because no, it no. gets, gets hard. I've actually seen people just pop that out of there and just eat it without any water at all, just gnaw on it. Oh, no, thank uh, you. No, no. I mean, that's... Uh, I that's not good. I don't recommend uh, it. <laughs> yeah, well, I think that's... Uh, I'd be happier not doing that. <laughs> Yeah, a little easier <laughs> to eat when it's soft. All right, it's been uh, three minutes. All right. So and, uh, yep, now just go ahead and peel that lid completely off. It should come off real mm -hmm. easy when it's wet. It's really and hot. And then, yep, just uh, stick that stir forward, it. stir it up. Yep, yep. So. Um, nice, yeah. Yeah, so there's some soupiness. Mm -hmm. What do you, would, would you eat with a spoon or a fork? No, nope, fork. You? I usually eat it with a fork, um, you know, just... Yep, pick it up and blow on it, cool it mm -hmm. off. That, like mm -hmm. I said, that first bite's gonna burn your mouth. Yeah. Yeah, yeah because it's like a soup here, so maybe yeah. I put in too much water. No, no, it's supposed to be like that. Oh. Yeah. Ow! It burns my finger. Yep, there you go. <laughs> yep. Just blow on it for about 10 minutes. <laughs> 10 minutes later. Mm. Chicken. Mm -hmm. It was chicken, yes. <laughs> good, good. <laughs> it's always good when it tastes like what it's supposed to. <laughs> like what it's supposed to taste like. <laughs> right. Okay. Yeah, chicken, they've got a dozen, who knows how yeah, many flavors, yeah, yeah. I'm sure they say on their website, but... Yeah, um, they've got a lot of flavors. the The typical ones are chicken, hot chicken. There's a beef, I believe, a shrimp. Um, mm. Yeah. 
Well, you it can like continuing to eat it, so it's not bad. Yeah, yeah. It's not bad. And you get the only thing I've... some freeze-dried vegetables as a surprise once yeah, in a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think, um, yeah, yeah. My only concern is that it's a lot of, uh, like, noodles and pasta. It, it fills me up, but not for very long. Yeah, yeah, it's just a starch, and that's it. Mm. Yeah, and it's good for lunch, you know? Yeah, it's good enough. It's good enough. It'll hold you over. Yeah. Uh, I really... My favorite would probably be the mac and cheese. Yeah, really? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, I, don't know. I remember as a kid, um, you know, lunchtime, especially summers, mm. you know, playing basketball with my friends, and then, you know, I'm hungry, I want something quick, and I just run yeah. inside, get some, you know, some, some water, fill that yeah. up. And then mm. uh, grab the cup, walk out the door, yeah. and start eating it, yeah. walking walking back to the park. Yeah, it's fine. It's it's fine. Well, I'm glad you didn't hate any uh, hate any of them, honestly. So you seem to like uh, all of them. You'd try them again. Yeah, huh? it's um. I mean, I think uh, if you were like a. Uh, professional youtuber or chef you would probably oh this is disgusting i cannot <laughs> eat this i can't possibly eat this this is terrible you know it's not imported directly from yeah from italy or france or whatever uh, it's fine yeah. i'm sorry but it it's yeah it's, it's, it's suitable fine. yeah i mean if you've got the time to make ramen the night before and yeah and heat it back up the following day Jordan, yeah, good, good for you. <laughs> and the, the problem is if I'm just making food for myself, you know. Yeah, I do like cooking sometimes, but yeah, it, if it's I, I have, same for me. You know, probably like once a week, I enjoy uh, cooking a really yeah. nice meal. But um, you know, the rest of the time, I just don't have time for that stuff. No, no. And then when I'm cooking just for myself, it it takes the same same time if I'm cooking for one or for four people. Yeah, you know, uh, and and it yeah. And I have to pay for the ingredients mm -hmm. from halfway the way. And yeah, exactly. Yeah, things aren't necessarily well, portioned the way you need them to be. Go ahead and throw yeah. in a plug here. You know, um, yeah. and if you have that problem too, you can sign up for HelloFresh and you get HelloFresh orders. And... Oh yeah, that reminds me of, of this <laughs> week's sponsor. Yeah, <laughs> no, but uh, HelloFresh. Honestly, yeah. um, no, I did use HelloFresh. I don't know if they have anything like that over there in Denmark. We there's do, several, we do, we do. Uh, Blue Apron, HelloFresh. Uh, I mean, there's specialty ones if you're a yeah. keto. Um, stuff like that, but um, we did that for several, several months, and man, I, mm. I don't think there was a single meal that we didn't like, and this is not well, not an advertisement or, or a plug at all, it, it, my wife and I. I um, we have multiple of those, <laughs> even Hello Fresh has come to oh, dinner, really? I think. Interesting. Yeah, but I, I had one that's called, in Danish it was Årstiderne, it means the seasons, mm -hmm. so they would try to buy fresh produce depending on the season. Yeah, gotcha. So, um, yeah, but Hello but Fresh it, was really good. And, um, I remember having this um, this pork chop one that had um, what, what's it called? Demi glaze. This demi glaze sauce. Mm, it was just yeah, amazing. Yeah. And my wife and I kept trying to remake that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I liked it. I got it like they came with the new. A box, two boxes, one full of uh, vegetables and stuff, mm -hmm. and one with ice in it for the things yep. that have to be cold. Yep, yep. So I had for five days, so it was, uh, I, I ran it for a year. It was good fun. Yeah, yeah. We yeah. The only reason we stopped is we couldn't keep up with it because uh, we were getting oh. three meals a week and, uh, you know. Yeah. yeah, it was during the pandemic I got it because I didn't go to work and I didn't have a, at the cafeteria a lot of good food, so I... It was good to have something to be inspired and get out yes. of the usual. Yeah. Good. Anyway, also approved. And if there's anyone watching left, thank you for watching. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and all that good stuff. And we have plenty of these videos tasting stuff and uh, we have a whole exchange of care packages yeah so. yeah we got a couple more videos at least i know we've yeah. got uh the a1 steak sauce the frank's yeah. red hot sauce and um what else oh the uh, uh sweet baby ray's barbecue sauce is there anything else yep. on your side is, is that it mm, plenty of them mock handy, Lots is there? Of handy. okay 
Yeah. Okay. And you also have something ahead of you. Yeah, mm -hmm. I've got a, a couple um, pieces of licorice and such. Yeah, yeah. All the good stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we got the, <laughs> the vodka one too, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's a lot of things, so yeah. All right. Yeah, we better get stopped for now. Yeah. And uh, good fun. Cheers. Until next time. Cheers. Bye.